Okay, so hi guys, this is Clay update number four, I think. So I got some charms and deco pieces and <coughs> two figurines, which I will save for last. So first I'll start off with the stuff that I don't really like too much. So another swirly lollipop. This one's face is on the side. And I have so many mint stuff because I have an obsession with making these canes. I'll make a tutorial for them if you want. Because I make a lot of tutorials. No reason why. But I just do. So I have this lollipop. Dump that. So this lollipop. This candy with its wrapper. And this one, but its wrapper fell off so I gave it a kind of angry face. Then I have this Harry Potter, which I had, it needed to be baked for about two weeks, but I finally got around to baking him. Yeah, and I used jump rings for his glasses. And I think I showed this. I might have not, but it's this Funfetti cake inspired by someone on DeviantArt. So I used TLS, and this is just a flat piece because I need to practice my cake texturing. And I used pastels to make the little funfetti-ness. <coughs> then I have the strawberry deco pieces. And I have a tutorial on them, and I'll link somewhere around here in between my spirit fingers. So this one I made after filming the tutorial. And this is the one I made in the tutorial, and I actually added the leaves anyway, because I, I found a better way to do it. I like how that came out. Yeah. Then I made these two smaller Pokeballs. These are really fun to make. And then this one larger one. Then I have this Rarity Marshmallow. And she's the, my favorite character of all time, ever. Buried a marshmallow. She's mad because she's a marshmallow. And then I made this toilet from 0903 Photography's tutorial, but it's not on her channel. It's on DIY Crafters, which is an awesome channel. I will also link them somewhere around here. Um, so instead of doing the love stinks i just made it a regular one and when i added the pastels the water got too dark so it's it's just um in those toilets with blue water and i don't really think you can tell but there's poop in there and then the poop has this little face on it and they're connected by a chain and the tutorial is really good for this except instead of adding this first and then the seat i added the seat and then that yeah, and I mixed the white with translucent to make it look more like porcelain, but I don't really think it did anything. <coughs> so, yeah. And I really like this Kimaki. And the poop sits on the toilet like that. And the toilet paper, the toilet, and the poop all have a face. And then my favorite is this. This rarity took me so long it took such a freaking long time and then once i finally got her she wouldn't stand up so i had to add cold porcelain onto her legs and then send her legs down and look she's still not standing up that's not cool i'm gonna show you the picture that inspired me but here's the front and everything here her hair was originally made with colored clay but i don't really like the color that it came out as ah! my internet's slow because i'm publishing a video right now all right okay fine never mind where i got the inspiration from but so her tail took the longest and then next were her eyes so i think she came out awesome and she's going into my collection of ponies oh oh now it loads now it loads of course so, oh, where'd I put it? Oh, I put her over here, so. Tail, body, face, whatnot. And then, this still has to be baked and painted, cleaned up a little. It's apple bloom. 
And I think I got her size way off proportion. She's the same size as Rarity. But if you, if you compare her to the Fluttershy that I have, she's about the right size. Yeah. So, yeah, okay, let's see. Can I get her up for you? I don't know. But let's make charm update. Why am I putting her there? She doesn't go there. So that's my charm update. So bye guys.